Okay, so there's a player that just broke Roblox. Like, I'm not even joking. They made an avatar that just completely breaks the game. No, they actually sent me a DM, asked me to join their game so I could check this out. I had no idea what I was about to find. So I popped on the recording button and, well, you're about to find out what happened. Okay, so my friend just invited me to this game. She apparently has an avatar that breaks Roblox and wants to show it off here. So let's go ahead and see what's going on. Go ahead and click play. What in the world is that? Um, th wait, wait, what the heck? So, uh, bro, wait, hold on. I'm gonna tell them to move around. Like, this is actually crazy. So they're moving around. It's going, it's going wild. It's going crazy. Now, what's wild about this is even though their avatar is huge, their actual hitbox is still right here in the middle. So if you're like a player on MM2, you're trying to like grab them or something, <laughs> you, you won't be able to see anything because they're actually in the middle of this giant marshmallow blob. Okay, so I think I know how to do this. Let me show you. Okay, so first, let me actually explain how layered clothing works. So here's my normal avatar. I have some layered clothing on. I have the jacket, I have the shirt, we got the pants, the shoes, basic stuff. Now, to let you guys better understand this, I'm just gonna switch to, let's say, the penguin outfit here. Go ahead and reset my character. And you can see, here's the, well, normal default penguin. Now, if I were to put on some classic non late why, why is the catalog not working? <laughs> Roblox is like, no, 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 no video for you right now. Anyway, if I put on some classic, Classic t-shirts, non-layered clothing. Let's just go ahead and reset, see what this looks like on the avatar. So you can see, even though I'm wearing a shirt and pants, part of the avatar actually does not get covered up by the pants. The pants aren't even showing. But you can see, I'm wearing pants. There they are right there, but you can't actually see them. Now, how layered clothing works is it actually covers up anything underneath it, and it wraps around the avatar. So now if I reset with some layered clothing on, you can see we can see the pants. You know, the tail kind of sticks out there a little bit. We got this. We got the shoes on. We got the shirt. Every everything looks great. You wouldn't even know it's a penguin if it wasn't for the arms and tail. Okay, so let me just go ahead. I'm gonna reset my avatar back to the default Roblox boy. Let me show you guys how to do this. So shout out to Ella here. She actually made a tweet with all the stuff. Here's all the items we need right here, along with these layered clothing clothes. So first off, we need the legs from the Snow Queen bundle. This is gonna cost you a little bit of Roblox. I'm sure there's probably other ways to you know do this. So we'll, we'll try and play around with some free options later on. Then we need the Jester set. Already got it. Then we need the head from the elemental crystal golem. Go ahead and buy that. And then for the clothes, we need the... What, what is this? A blue bow off shoulder? <laughs> okay. We need the A-line ball gown with the heart necklace. And this is the one that, well, puts it all together. The marshmallow white bear suit. Okay, snow queen legs. There's the right one. There's the left one. We need the jester equinox torso. There it is. The elemental crystal golem head. And well, here's the avatar. Here's what it looks like without the layered clothing looks, you know, weird, but normal. Now let's put on the clothing. Blue bow off shoulder. There we go. We need the marshmallow white bear. As you can see already, it's looking kind of weird. And then we need the, the dress, the A-line ball gown. Well, now if we reset our avatar here, now our avatar is this. <laughs> Obviously, if you want to put on a different head or customize it further than this, you can. But these are the items required to just make it work. Let's go in a game and, well, check this out. So this works in any game that has layered clothing enabled. Any of them. Let's hop into Pet Simulator X. Okay, so we're in Pet Simulator X. And as you can see, it very clearly works here. Go ahead and just take out our pets, see what this looks like. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Amazing. Let's go ahead and try a game like Jailbreak. Go ahead and choose Police, Play, and... Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's even bigger in Joe. Oh my god. Whoa, dude. It literally is breaking the helicopter. I can't even fly the helicopter straight because the avatar is breaking it. Dude, what in the world? I literally can't fly it. I'm not even joking. The avatar will not fly. I mean, the helicopter. Hel I mean, you, you get what I'm saying. What about a competitive game like Murder Mystery 2? I mean, this will give you a pretty big advantage. If your opponents can't see it, they can't hit you. And yes, yes, it also works at MM2. Here we go. The best part is, is also you can dance. You want to floss? Go for it. You want to do an emote like the hero landing? Well, you can do that too. Maybe we got, uh, let's see, maybe a godlike. Oh, yeah, yeah, you can do that as well. Everyone's like, wait, what in the world's going on here? What the, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Bruh. Bruh. All right, so as you can see, here we are. We're in MM2, and uh, how are they going to be able to see us? They ain't going to be able to see us. Where, where's Cree Crave? I don't know. All I see is marshmallow fluff. This is great. Someone in the chat said, why? 
Okay. You know, like I said, you can customize this more. I can put on the teddy bear head if I want. I could even go ahead and throw on the Creek Craft hat. There it is right there. And well, now I'm literally a giant polar bear Creek Craft marshmallow that is going to break Roblox. You can probably take it a step further and play around with the scale of the avatar, make it bigger, change the proportions, all that stuff. But I know what you guys are saying. Creek Craft, how can I do this for maybe free and you know, the least amount of Roblox possible? So I've actually been testing it and what she says in this tweet is actually true. So you do need these clothes, these three right here, the shoulder, the what dress, the marshmallow suit. And then you need the legs from the Snow Queen. Obviously, you can't just get that. You have to actually search up the Snow Queen actual package, which is unfortunately 500 Robux. So all in all, it seems the cheapest way to do this is 70 Robux plus 150 plus 65 plus 500. How much is that? 785. So basically $10 worth of Robux and you get to break the game. Thank you guys all so much for watching. Go check out some of my other videos. Hopefully Roblox doesn't get mad at me for this. And um, I'll see you guys next time. You know, still bald. Bye.